I've made my choice, Addy. I'm calling her the Jackdaw. A sly bird I loved as a child back in Swansea. A dark little creature, no? Did it rub you wrong when I took this brig as mine own? <laughs> it was the sort of rub I have learned to enjoy, sailing among faces of such fairness. Huh. It's true. Most of these men wouldn't accept you as a captain. So what fair role would complement such unfairness? I'll be your quartermaster. Nothing less. Damn. All right. Take it. And as quartermaster, have you any immediate counsel for this Tyro captain? Rest and repast would do us good before Nassau. Water for drinking. Hunting for food and repairs. Well reasoned, sir. Hunting, that shall be. We'll find a decent place to drop anchor. We're about to learn how to hunt right now, aren't we? Despite a few items in the hold earlier. Powder and a few pistols. I think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> It's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of linstocks heaped like tinder. And one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder, closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and proper. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. Clogs touch holes in need of scraping. Corrosion on the bodies, barrel swabs as naked as knives. Just talking about getting the upgrades so and getting the weapons and stuff. Use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. But we cannot win every battle with snares and shouts. So worry about your own armaments when it suits you. But don't forget about your jackdaws. No, indeed. We'll make it a point to keep this ship and its crew in fine condition. Damn straight. Upgrading this thing is gonna be like number one. It's gonna be number one. It's like top priority. Drop anchor down here, boss. Yeah, I wish we could have gotten more jumps than that, but it's okay. Um, so this is officially sequence three. Shoot an iguana and air assassinate an ocelot. <laughs> okay, fine. Hunting and crafting, yeah. Okay, so we'll figure out the crafting menu as we as we go along. Damn, you like that fucking you like that marksman mode? Admire that one for a second. Feels a little bad. I like iguanas. I like them. I like lizards, man. Lizards are so cool. Hello. I'm gonna air assassinate you now, buddy. Thank you. Stay just in my fucking. There you go. Fuck, was that annoying, dude? Not really. Just going around doing this stuff on the island. Craft a new. Okay, okay, we go with crafting. And then we get the pistol holster. Okay, so now we got two pistols. And now we got some new stuff. And I actually like it. You can actually like see the differences in the armor and stuff. It's like a sword. Ahoy, Captain. Find what you need. My needs and wants are oceans apart, mate. But I did fashion myself a new holster. All I need now is a pistol to lie in it. Yeah. Taken from the holds, just as you said. A little more than a blowpipe. But it'll do. Can't wait, dude. We'll get the so, real ones. Are we rested? Or should we idle a while longer? Best way, Anchor. I think the crew is itching to reach civilization. You find no civilization in NASA, but it's a fine place to be merry all the same. Yes, it is. I would live there, man. I would live in Nassau.
Thank you. Go on, Captain Queer Nubs. Bahamas? Tell me I'm under arrest. I should have figured that, honestly. Tell me! Jesus. Fly away, boy -o. Back to your master. Aye. We was privateers together before the wars ended. I'll see you ashore. Dude, this is it. This is where Black Flag starts right here. This is where it all just... Mm, look at all that stuff to do. <laughs> yes, dude. Can't wait to get to all that. Bam, dude. Just like that. And uh, on top of that, we are literally right here. By God, What's up, you're a sight for salty eyes. Come you in and have a drink. Morning, all. Oh, I can't wait. Who's this? Adewale, the Jackdaw's quartermaster. I dig Jackdaw. it. <laughs> you named your brig after a poxy bird. Adi, these lads are the better part of our growing confederacy here. Ed Thatch, Ben Hornigold, James Kidd. Hmm. You let him carry a pistol, do you? Peace, Ben. Ade saved my life. And now we're looking to find a crew to fill out the rest of my ship. Well, there's scores of capable men about. We use caution. Like Edward, six after out of Wally. Ship the King's Sailor showed up a fortnight back, causing trouble and knocking about like they own the place. All right. I'll see you I can muster. Dude, show the respect. Show them the respect that Eddie deserves. All right, yeah, this is all old news for me. Let's go around beating up, getting pirates. Disarmed? Come on, man. Cheers, Eddie. Cheers, mate. I think I messed up. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna attack my way into this fight. Yeah, disarm them and kill them. Take it. That's all I need for now. Just two. A time. Captain Kenway, just in time. I'll see you back aboard. Yes, sir. You know you will. Yeah, more nighttime shenanigans. It's more nighttime gameplay, so I can't be can't be loud. Oh, I can't disarm this guy. It's no fun. Unless maybe like I tackle him. Uh, oh my, what was that? What just happened? <laughs> nah, I'm still gonna tackle him. I'm still gonna tackle him. I'm just gonna, yeah, I need to. This, is, this feels like unfinished business. There you go. Okay, I accidentally got these guys killed last time, so let's go ahead and not get them. Let's go ahead and just save them this time. And be anonymous. Shoot the rope to say, Oof, I got you, I got you. Just in case. I remember this one. This pirate bears the blood Come of many fight. innocent the on his hands. We need to hang him. His Majesty's Honorable Representative has decreed the sentence shall... Pang, dude. Use the hidden blades for a sec. I like it. I like it. I like it. Cool. Get him, you marksman. Now I have to try and kill this guy. Um, this doesn't concern you, Mr. Mr. Mosin Man. 
you have no part in this. He's not even a part of this. He's not even supposed to be a part of this. There we fucking go, dude. That's our captain right there. Or so, apparently. I thought Edward was the captain, but I guess not. I'm gonna get to all these assassin contracts. I'm gonna get to all of them, and they're all gonna be lit, and they're probably gonna have their own video, honestly. Because, dude, this is just, it's just such a good time, this game. You know what, matter of fact, BRB. Now you'll wanna sail somewhere rich with plunder. Have you heard of a place called the Observatory? Aye, it's an old legend, like El Dorado or the Fountain of Youth. Have you heard? It's meant to be a Delicious. temple or a tomb, adding a treasure of some kind. That's it. See here. Oh, oh rot. It's fairy stories you prefer a gold, is it? It's worth more than gold, Thatch. Ten thousand times above what we could pull off any Spanish ship. Robbing the king to pay his porpoise That's is how we earn our keep here, lad. It ain't a fortune. It's a fantasy. Damn. James knows what's up. I like it. Um, yeah, this, you know, just seems fitting. Do I have a problem? Maybe. But I'm attracted to its dangers, no less. Prizes and blunder. Prizes and blunder. Morning, can we? Working on my pirate Not accent. Not a bad-looking tinderbox you got there. You sound a bit... Green horny gold. Is it envy? Is mine bigger than yours? No, I reckon it's this Jamaican funk. I prefer the Spanish stuff. So, you've got yourself a fancy brig now. Fine. Well, I'm gonna teach you how to say it all right. And how to take a prize the proper way. So... That's... Basically, we'll catch uh, you up with the old a, fishing a naval village. tutorial. Aye. Basically, a naval tutorial. That's what we got. Where's your helmsman, Kenway? I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Keeps me alert. Let's make some headway, shall we? I've no need for schooling. How many prizes did we take together as privateer? <laughs> There's a chasm of difference between joining a raid. Captaining one. We're looking out for merchants, boys. Them that's fat with cargo. Find us a schooner with that spyglass, Kenway. Hey, there we go. There's a prize worth taking. Good. This is pretty, uh, pretty straightforward. Use the spyglass to see how much stuff they have on their ship. Take the ship, board it, take it. This leaves a spell for soft mind. For your victims must always have in the back of their minds the uneasy idea of a snap at any moment and unseen them from prick to stone. Fire what can is you. The land of whose strikes it must be. Get his ass. No there you go. That's how you know it's incapacitated. Although it can be done. Tight notes. Tight note, we're good to go. All right. Oh, there you go. That was gonna be a little bit more difficult than that. Dude, no problem, dude. Literally not even a problem. Just so you know, we probably won't be doing schooners ever again. I am Captain Hornigold, and this is my crew. We're sailors like yourselves, but quite unalike in our purpose. For we intend to take all that you owe. Yet no harm shall befall any man so long as he remains at ease. Is that clear? No me mate, señor. Tengo familia. Se lo suplico. Anyone speak English? English? Little bit. 
Tell your friends we're stealing your goods. And we won't hurt nobody if everyone stays as still as a sandbar. You got that? A little snake. Please do repeat. Oh, for fuck's sake. Lock him in the hole and take everything that isn't nailed down. Just so, like, uneasy and, uh, like, loony, lunatic, lunaticish about it. It's very piratey. Yeah, see, there you go. It's a shaky feeling sailing about with this much stolen car. Twenty rum. Get used to it. We'll need Betcha. to take a few more prizes to make this a profitable day. Basically, just gonna be looking for another uh, schooner with just like that, just like that one. Shanties make the open world just travel just so much better, so much more enjoyable. Just listening to these shanties. And then having it switch to just straight pirate combat music. It's great. This game is fantastic. It makes me really want to live out in the sea. I like it does. Not so much as a pirate, you know, because I, I don't want to know what happens to pirates if you get caught. But it makes me just want to live that kind of lifestyle, you know? Bam, bro. There we go. Loot 20 rum. So specific. That's because they want you to know how to look for materials. You know, if you need like a certain material, because they're going to be ships, they have like a bunch of metal, a bunch of wood, a bunch of rum. They'll have all that stuff. Half a dozen scores of that size, and they'll be set for a year. Now let's sell this cargo and fix up your jack door with a few more trinkets. Soddy. Yes. I'm looking for a prize that'll set me up for life. I'll be king of the West Indies then. We came to Nassau to get away from the likes of kings. Well, I'll be a man of property and promise anyway. Jesus, let that dream go, lad. Nassau is the place to be, not England. Do you ever dream of the big score? He's still so trying to go back to his woman. Just split it and sail home. Sure, but it's only a dream. Every man hopes to find a dozen chests of gold with no owners. They're as rare as an honest king. Salt key. Salt key. Bank. I think it is. A neat little, just a neat little island type thing that you can fast travel to. Just another way of fast traveling around the world. This game is great. I love it. Whoops. I might have to go take care of all this stuff real quick. Finally get to learn about how to buy stuff with the jackdaw. It's about damn time. All we need to do is just, just keep buying upgrades, keep getting money, keep getting material. That's all it takes. And the pl oh, you gotta find the plants too, Morty. You gotta, you gotta find the plants, otherwise you don't know how to make them, Morty. That's good, Morty. 